Here's the Samsung Galaxy Tab S9. I'm going to show you how to set this up step by step. First thing, go ahead and turn it on. Press and hold that power button until it boots up. And you're in the welcome screen here. And right away, your stylist should work here. Let's see. Yep. So I'm going to go with English in the US here. I'm going to tap on Start. For your review, look at these three things. Read through those. You must enable at least the first two in order to proceed. Okay, so I'm just fine with both of those. I'm going to tap on Agree. Easy setup with another device. Sign in automatically and copy your settings, accounts, and more from another iPhone or Android phone, tablet, or iPad. Keep your other phone, tablet nearby and unlocked. If you want to do it that way, then choose down here if you have a Galaxy or Android or iPhone or iPad. For myself, I want a clean, fresh copy on this. I want to do set up manually. Choose Wi-Fi network. So let me get my Wi-Fi in here. I'm going to put in my Wi-Fi password. My password is in. I will tap connect now. It says connect it right there. Getting your tablet ready, this may take a few minutes. Copy apps and data. You can choose to transfer your apps, photos, contacts, Google account, and more. Okay, so if you have a different device, you can transfer everything onto here. If you do, you just want to tap on next right here, and it says you need your old Android, tablet or phone, iPhone, or a iPad, okay? And then you would tap on next, have the device over here, but for myself, I'm going to go ahead and click on back button here. And again, I'm going to do a fresh, clean copy. So I'm going to click on don't copy for myself. Google sign in, basically your Gmail. You can go ahead and sign in now, or you can skip and do it later, or skip and never do it if you wish, okay? But for myself, I'm going to skip, and I'll just go ahead and sign in later, and I'll skip right there as well. Google services, read through these, use location, allow scanning, send usage and diagnostic data. These are all optional, okay? But I'm fine with having all these toggled on and I will tap accept. Protect your tablet. Go ahead and add a password, okay? You can always skip and do it now, but I would recommend at least put something in right now, okay? I'll just go ahead, I'm just gonna do a pin for myself. Six digit pin, let me go ahead and input it. And then I'm gonna tap on Continue, and I'm going to have to input it one more time to confirm. And I'm going to tap on OK right there. Now, after a setup is all complete and whatnot, you can always go back and you can add a face ID or fingerprint as well. Your Samsung account, you can go ahead and sign in. If you don't have an account, you can create one, or you can skip and sign in later, or you can skip and never do it. But myself, I'll skip and I'll do mine later. I'll skip down here as well. Samsung services, make sure you read through all of these, okay? And all of these are all optional, okay? But I'm fine with having all these toggled on. I will tap Agree. Choose your display preference. Do you like it light or do you like it dark? I like it dark myself. I'll keep it on dark. I'll tap on next. You're all set up. So from here, you can go ahead and explore your gallery or you can just go ahead and tap on finish right there. And voila, looks like we're in business. Questions or issues? Just comment below. Good luck.